listen Do your own math and learn the stuff that you are missing Create your own path with your own vision Hey, this is Rodney Porter for Homeless, Not Helpless, dot TV. Today's date, February 17th, 2010, Wednesday, Hump Day. Today's show, Survival Skills. just wanted to show through my lesson mine just so happened to be homelessness but whatever your situation is it's not a problem it's a situation think positive whatever it is you can do it you can do it where do I start well, I'm a typical average American, Afro-American kid in America. Listened to my mom, respected my elders, going to school, no trouble, having fun, no police record. Police officer still asked me twice, can't believe it. No police record of any kind. But surviving is just that, getting through tough times, the rough times, when you're in a hardship, when you're in a panic and a frenzy and you can't do anything about it. So you think. Me, it's kind of crazy. I always live with my mom as long as I could, till it was time to move. And then I did move and move with the mother of my first child. That didn't work out. She kicked me out the house. So what, what do I do? I'm not going back to my mom's house. That's my thinking. So I said, let me just do what I have to do. So I just stayed in my car, went to safe places, which I thought were safe, less foot traffic, no opportunity for people to look in your car. It's not a crazy, souped up car. It's a typical, average, all American car. So going from place to neighborhood to neighborhood to neighborhood, staying down at a certain time at night, because if I get up, somebody has seen me, call the police on me, I have to move. Or they might give me a fine, so this this has been going on and still going on. And so now, I'm actually, by going through all of that shit, I'm glad I did. I had to go through that to toughen me up. Because this is some serious stuff out here. It's not a game. It's really not. And so now I'm in a situation where I'm working with a friend of mine, he's a handyman, a contractor, and the house that we're fixing on, it's time to go now, next few days or so. So now I'm going back into my car because I need a couple more months having received uh, SSI. I want to make the right steps, not the wrong steps when choosing a place to stay. Because I have two beautiful, beautiful daughters and I have to make the right choice the first time, not the second time. So surviving is just like Ali, bobbing, Sugar Ray Leonard, weaving, bobbing and weaving. Not taking the full blow of what's going on. But one thing you have to do in this time of recovery, that's what I'm going through here at Homeless Not Helpless TV. You get a chance to see me go through it. And I can't tell you how invigorating and 
therapeutic that is. Very much so. I needed just a couple more months to have everything just right. I have to get my car right, working perfectly. And I'm not paying a car note. I have a great car. It's an economy car. Don't go backwards. Don't pay a note. Yeah, the car looks nice. Well, my car looks nice. It's older, but it looks nice. It's clean. So I'm going to do the little things I need to do, but the main thing is getting them running, the transmission, the axles, the tune-up, car shaking, it's putt-putting, survival skills, making a way, doing it, but you have to work for your recovery, you have to put time in, put money back in your recovery, invest in your recovery. That's the only way you'll see a brighter day, as you can see here. This is Rodney Porter. Wanted to get out the word survival. We must attain skills to survive in America and in this planet we live within. Not one skill, two skills, multiple, a plethora of skills. Be flexible to survive. I'm going to keep on surviving through the grace of God. Thank you, Jesus. This is Rodney Porter broadcasting live from Los Angeles, California. Homeless not helpless TV. Have a good one. See you.